Hey guys, welcome back. We are going to have the short video on how to do certain things. So today I'm going to show you how to connect the power supply to your motherboard. There is two main important connections to the mother motherboard that requires minimally it requires to turn on the motherboard. One is this one, the 20 plus pin connector and then the four or the eight pin connector. Now it's some power supplies only have two and some other power supplies they have more than two which would be required for certain motherboards which have multiple uh, plugs. So sometimes the plugs are together, sometimes it's separate. As you can see, this can be joined together to make um, a, a 4 plus 4 or it can be used as single. It doesn't matter which one you use. Now if you look close here, this motherboard only has uh, one set of those. Sometimes there would be two sets together, that's when you need both. Now here you only need to plug it in one possible way as you can see here there is a notch here and this notch is supposed to touch here so this is the correct way. On some other boards it might be turning around or another way but you would know by the notch and most of the time 99.9% .9 it would only go in one way due to the design of the thing. So you can plug this here this is one of the cable that you need to connect yeah as you can see this one did not go inside this is the correct one for that side and i'm for the sake of simplicity i'm going to use the same one here this is the bigger connector this has been common for the most of the pcs for a long time and this one would plug into this power plug here again it would only go in one way uh, there is a clip here and there is a lock mechanism here so how we would do that you better hold it together and bring it, align it and press it and push it down. Do not press too much pressure. Maybe you would crack the motherboard, but at the same time, you need to have enough pressure till it all fills in down and this lock is engaged. So this is what you need to do to get the motherboard up and running with the minimal requirement. These two power, without these two power, the motherboard would not turn on. The C this is the CPU power and this is the power for the motherboard. Thank you for watching and I hope you learned something today.